Hello guys, it's Alex from Investor and welcome to your 39th basic Python tutorial. In this tutorial, I want to be uh, I want to talk about check buttons and uh, basically write another program like we did here with the password. So let's open a new window right here. And again, once we open a new window, you want to paste the beginning part of the uh, class and uh, the constructor because that's still the same. And then you can uh, leave everything else. Then we're going to create the widgets method again. As always, you can sort of see the pattern of how to create these now. Uh, pretty simple actually. Once you get create, uh, do more programs with it. And what this is going to do is create widgets for, it's going to be like a movie uh, program. Like what type of movie person you want. And uh, I, I, we want to label. So you always want to have self. Then the text is going to say choose your favorite movie type. And then, um, you know, yeah, I'm going to do grid. And you can just do it on one line here, and it's just going to work. And the previous ones, I showed you, you know, having another line. Well, you don't necessarily have to do that. Obviously, this is going to make your line much longer, but it, it, it can get your job done in one uh, line. Then we want the instruction label. So this is going to be instructions. And I have label self. Text is going to be select all that apply. And just do grid. We're going to have row 1 for this. Column 0. Uh, sticky plus W. Alright, go back. Then, actually creating the check button. Uh, okay, so I'm going to have three different types of. Uh, check buttons comedy drama and romance so let's make the comedy one so comedy check button you're gonna do self dot comedy is equal to boolean bar and for check buttons you want boolean because it's either you have the uh, check button on or off so true or false so you can sort of see uh, my logic behind that. Then it's check button, that's the widget. Uh, again, always have this thing capital. And then self, the text is going to be comedy. Then variable is self.comedy. Command is self.update text. And again, we're going to have to write a uh, thing for that then that grid row equals two column column is zero sticky is rest all right so we have one check button done now let's make another one drama check button I'm just gonna copy this right here because it's about the same thing then go back to here paste it the row is going to be 3 for this it's going to be uh, this one's drama and this is going to be drama same thing for uh, how do I how do I do this? I want to go down one line. Yeah, I don't like the scrolling thing for Python really, but whatever. I'm gonna have to deal with that. And let's make one for romance. Just gonna paste it again. Have this equal to four. You want a new line. You want this as row romance. And then change this to romance. All right. Once you have that done, I oh, have to go back to get a new line. All right. All right. So we got our three 
buttons that we need. Now we need a text field to actually show the result or what it's going to say. So result is going to be text widget and we're going to have salt. We're going to make the width 40. I think that's reasonable. Height is 5. And a wrap is word. Then we're going to do result. Gonna put down to the grid. See now this is the type of thing where you put two lines. Uh, the only problem when you have one line is it's going to go super long like just before and it's going to extend off the page. But okay, here we have everything that we need for create widgets. Now for the status of the check button. We're going to do update text self and it's going to update text widget and display uh favorite movie types and we're gonna have likes equal to just nothing right now so empty string and if self dot comedy dot gets or get sorry not gets get put that colon there likes plus equals and basically what this means is if this is true you don't need to have equal equal to true because uh, that's just something in Python that's already uh, done it's just a shortened way of doing it we're gonna have uh, you like comedy if self dot drama dot get spell that right okay. Likes plus equals you like drama. If self dot romance dot get likes is gonna equal uh, you like romantic. Okay. Then after that, we want to put the result. Uh, we're gonna delete it first. Don't forget to do that. So 0, 0, end. And then you want to insert the new one. So insert 0, 0 and type in likes. Alright. Root equals TK. Uh, root dot title is um, movie chooser or something. Then app equals application root. Gotta make sure you have that one. Root main loop is gonna get it. Save this. I'm gonna save this movie chooser. Hopefully we don't have any errors. Run this baby up and yes, we have this working except all of this is comedy. So let's see what we did here. Oh yeah, yeah. That's stupid. Yeah, I forgot to change the text when I was copying all of these. Romance. Nothing. Not error, just all comedy. I mean, that's not really right. So, okay, now we have this right here. Oh, what the? Okay, no, okay. This is not even responding. Alright, okay, what is going on here? Okay, I, I gotta rerun this. Okay, run this thing, and then you have movie choosers. So let's click on all three. Then it automatically updates. You like comedy, you like drama, you like uh, romantic. And then once you uncheck it, it, you know, it disappears, basically. You see how it works right here. But that's what we wanted to do in this video right here. And, uh, yep, it achieved my goals, basically. Uh, you can see, now you know what radio buttons, oh sorry not radio buttons, check buttons do. In the next tutorial we'll be talking about radio buttons. Hopefully you enjoyed this uh, tutorial and learned how to do this. Uh, if you have any questions or you know have any errors please let me know. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Please subscribe if you still haven't and I will see you guys in the next tutorial.